going on back here in the Lava Rock Aquaponic Garden. Another Thursday update, and water level is a little high. I stole some out of the hot tub. Um, look right over in this general area that you can't see, and uh, we got some dripping going on. It's right here where the two beds meet each other, and it's not the pipe. I already checked the pipe. I thought that would have to be the, the reason right there due to how bad it's leaking because it's actually dripping. But uh, no, it apparent, I, I can't tell how the heck it's leaking. The only thing I can tell is it seems like the water from the inside the bed, which is about that far below the plywood, is somehow wicking the water up into the plywood, going out to the outer edges of the plywood, and then dropping off. So that's pretty neat. Um, and then you see this side, and it's completely dry. Hmm. Um, well, we got growing on over here, just jungle of a mess in here. Got all kind of uh, tomatoes back there in the background, topping up over there. I don't know how the heck they're living, because the hydro tube's been turned off for weeks. The mint is just taking off like crazy. That was another thing I thought. Maybe the mint grew into the pipes and actually moved them and made them start leaking, but nothing. Pipes are completely bone dry. Very weird. Um, little Brussels sprout back here. I don't know. Like in the cold weather, I guess? Cooler weather. Uh, this pepper still looking half decent. Still, this pod's starting to turn a little bit. And this little pepper over here, not looking so bad. Coming back pretty good. Uh, like I said, water level is now a little high. Um, I don't think you can see right over there, but see, it's just actively dripping. And the only thing I can tell is the plywood's wet. And, uh, I checked all the pipes. Um, lettuce over here doubles. I think, right? Yeah, I got two lettuces right there next to each other. Got my gigantic strawberry. Look at this guy, man. Tons of new growth popping out there. Looks like extra little uh, strawberries popping off. I never saw runners or anything, but it appears that this guy's taking off. And then look over on this side. Wow. All kind of berries. Look, that's a nice berry down there. Another one forming right back there. And then flowers. That one actually has a berry in the center of it right there. Very neat. So I've never seen a berry in November before, but I have now. Uh, more lettuce over here. These two, the crisscross ones, and the little loner right in the back. Got a crappy looking leaf right there. Um, more lettuce right over here. And this lettuce looks like it's going to bolt. So, alright. Didn't even get that big. Um, hey, we got another little lettuce down there. Uh, another one in the background laying down. My ooh, onion here, not looking so hot. Um, more lettuce down here. Tons of uh, tomatoes everywhere. There's that one with a hole in it. I left it on. Another one. Ooh, one fell in the background there. But tons and tons of them. Look how big these guys are. I've never seen them this big. But I'm sure you can get them that big because they are now. Uh, looks like another hole starting right on that one, but it's just covered with all kind of tomatoes, so I guess we'll see how long they're going to last this year. Um, baby broccoli, looking awesome. My little tiny peppers down here, I don't know how they're surviving, uh, being that small. And uh, it's just two, I guess it's only like 60, 58 or something like that. But it'll get colder tonight. I still haven't fixed the greenhouse, so we'll get a little airflow. Still have some pretty flowers on here. One right over here. And tons and tons of berries from the Malabar, or, or, yeah, Malabar spinach. So, tons of uh, seeds popping up. Uh, more tomatoes just hanging down. My little jalapeno. One turned all the way red. Sweet. Oh, yeah. There we go. Uh, you can see that right there. I got some corking going on. That's how I like my jalapenos. Uh, I didn't even check this before. Yeah, we got a couple pods on there. Just starting to form. Uh, crappy looking leaves over there. So I guess I'm going to have to pull this thing off. Hey, it came right off. Oh, it's still green at the top. Hmm. Uh, what else do we have? The Malabar back there. The lettuce. Oh, way over there. Little tiny lettuces. And... And we're over here, you can see the plywood's all saturated with water. So I don't know if it's the roots from these guys pulling the water up, it's hitting the uh, plywood and then moving outward or what, but it's just dropping. Um, oh, this mint starting to come back a little bit. See some new green growth there. Um, the cabbage, I don't know what's going on with this one. 
but it's just got multiple heads all over it. I topped this one, this one, nice and firm. Looks like we got some pest damage a little bit in here. Uh, same with this guy right over here. Look at that big old head, but a bunch of it looks like it was uh, munched on a little bit. Maybe it's rotten. I don't think it's rotting. And same with this guy right over here. And this little guy down here is looking awesome. And this multi-headed beast over here looking pretty good. So another shot of all these tomatoes all over this thing. This is probably the absolute best I've ever done with uh, the Indigo Rose tomatoes. Because those things are just loaded up. It's only, what is it? Let's do a quick count, shall we? Anything on the other side? No, so one, two, three, four, five. Wait, one, two, three, four, five. Looks like five indigo rose plants in here. And it's just all loaded up. So, But that's pretty cool. So I'm going to take my little jalapeno, go make a jalapeno popper out of that thing. And, uh, yeah get on to some more projects like fixing this freaking greenhouse before it actually gets cold so all right well thanks for walking around with me and don't forget to hit that subscribe button do updates in the greenhouse all the time thursdays we do lava rock aquaponic garden we've been talking about and then we come back for the hot tub aquaponic garden on tuesdays here there we go hot tub and i'm back for the super huts on monday so hit that subscribe button, come back, check out what we've all or what all we've got growing on here in the greenhouse. And uh, don't forget to do all that fun, happy social media stuff down below. And I will catch y'all in the next video. Till then. Later.